This is the Catholic Daily Journal for Thursday, May the 9th, 2019. It's the feast day in the traditional Roman calendar of St. Gregory Nazianzen. He was the Bishop of Constantinople in the 4th century, and he's also the poster child for the so-called patristic era of theology and preaching. He's part of a trio called the Cappadocian Fathers. This Gregory, along with two brothers, Basil and Gregory of Nyssa, took the scriptures and saw in just about every detail a number of levels. They read, for example, the stories of Moses and saw the historical narrative. Then they also saw moral lessons. And they saw certain symbolic details in which a Christian could see foreshadowing of Christ in the church. They took these theological insights into their preaching. So, for example, they might preach about Jesus walking on water. They would make the obvious connection about keeping one's eyes on Jesus in order to stay above the chaos of daily life. But then they would add thoughts about the boat symbolizing the church. Then they would add that the wood of the boat, like the wood of the cross, floats above the chaos of the waters, making the connection to Genesis and also to the parting of the Red Sea, wherein water symbolizes chaos and confusion. This kind of preaching was brand new to the Jewish mind, and it was hugely popular and successful in the early church. In fact, it was the most popular mode of preaching up until the end of the first Christian millennium. In the past hundred years, it's made a major comeback. And the writings of St. Basil, St. Gregory of Nyssa, and especially St. Gregory Nazianzen have gotten a lot of attention from younger and older clergy alike. Today is the birthday back in 1836 of French ophthalmologist Ferdinand Monnier. Everyone who's been to an eye doctor knows this guy's work. He brought the field forward with two major inventions. First, he described a unit of measurement called a diopter, which has to do with the power of a lens to magnify and or clarify. But we all know him for the Monnier chart, which has one big giant letter, and then a few smaller ones, and then a few smaller ones, all the way down to really tiny letters. And it always sadistically has Q's and G's, which look like O's, even if you have perfect vision. This man is the enemy of perfectionists everywhere. The Monnier chart is calibrated in such a way to test visual focus easily and cheaply. And it was a huge advance in the field of ophthalmology. Today, back in 1958, Alfred Hitchcock's film Vertigo had its world premiere in San Francisco. Sir Alfred Joseph Hitchcock, KBE, was an English film director and producer, and he's generally regarded as one of the most influential filmmakers of all time and across all genres. He made about 50 films, each exploring some genuine aspect of the art of filmmaking. And that's really the story of the man. In Vertigo, for example, we see Hitchcock's brilliant use of blocking that is managing the physical location and the posture of the actors in the frame. He uses blocking to foreshadow which relationships will strengthen and which will break, and of course also to describe which ones are in fact fake from the beginning. In Rebecca, he uses not only dialogue but background props and silences to build a tension that modern horror directors could only hope for. And of course, in Psycho, we have the first truly shocking twist ending. Hitchcock wasn't making films for a living. He was making them for an art. And Vertigo is high on the list of his greatest films. It opened today in 1958. Finally, according to Jim Henson, today is the birthday of Kermit the Frog. Kermit was first introduced in 1955 as part of Jim Henson's Muppets, and he almost always plays the archetypal straight man against over-the-top characters like Miss Piggy or Fozzie the Bear. It may not be easy being green, but it's not so hard being a puppet. The Catholic Daily Journal is supported by listeners like you. For more information, visit catholicunderground.com. Until next time, be on the lookout for the Lord at work in your life.